So I'm gonna be brewing a rye IPA today, and uh, it's going to be a 6.8% uh, ABV, hopefully, in the end, with uh, 1066 on uh, my original estimated original gravity, uh, estimated final gravity of 1014, um, bitterness level I've used at 58.6, established color at 10.3. 10.8 SRMs and so hopefully we'll get this I am going to put in three and three quarter pound pounds of pale two row milk and uh, yeah so that's what I got. Now we're gonna we're gonna uh, weigh it up, mill it, and uh, get that going. Converted. 
Nice color, nice clarity. It's clean. Now I stirred it up, we're at about 1078. color almost like a carrot orange just gonna pull the fermenter over here eventually once it's in the fermentation tank pitch the yeast oh no first I need to oxidate it so I'll use this trusty thing here 30 seconds per gallon and you leave it on at a quarter open. Plug it in there and bubble it up. I've got a bit more in here. We're still in the green. Okay, so I need to take a t uh, test. I need to take a test. Sanitize this thing. I'm just gonna go ahead and dip it in. Wow. Huh. 
We're at a 1082. <laughs> Let's taste it. Oh, it's bready, crackery, sweet, caramel, somewhat viscous. Well, it does have it. Well, right now it has a viscous viscosity level. It's pretty high. another brew day done in 5,000 fucking hours um, right on well I appreciate everyone for being here you guys middle fruit and Luke man cheers to you and cheers to everyone else as well uh, have a good night thanks for uh, skipping on in every once in a while or whatever you know and uh, checking this out you guys take it easy have a good night day wherever you're from in this beautiful world of course and uh, I don't have a last sip, so just have a good one.